Hi guys, there has been a very worrying development over the last couple of days. Anti-monarchist protesters being arrested. This is clearly a breach of the individual's free speech, which is protected. Article 10 of the European Convention on Human Rights says, Everyone has the right to freedom of expression. This right shall include freedom to hold opinions and to receive and impart information and ideas without interference by public authority and regardless of frontiers. This article should not prevent states from requiring the licensing of broadcasting, television and cinema enterprises. This right of course carries a responsibility that can be revoked if it's deemed to endanger national security or public safety. Please explain to me how the lady in this clip is a threat to the public. And there you have it. Now, what threat was this lady to the public? Was she shouting? Was she playing loud music? Was she attempting to enter the building? No, she was, as you can see here, holding up a sign. She was confronted by at least five police officers and escorted away by two. Now, How are people supposed to respond if, they're, if they don't agree with the, the monarchy, if they don't agree with King Charles? How are they supposed to express their disagreement? This woman is not making any sort of ruckus. She's not attempting to scale the wall or anything. She's simply standing outside this building, Buckingham Palace, I believe, with a sign saying, not my king. And it's deemed unacceptable. Now, others have taken the protest a little bit further. Uh, some have shouted at Prince Andrew, for example, and they have been escorted away, uh, roughed up actually before they've been escorted away. But once again, this is a dignified protest, but it's not allowed. And it seems that King Charles is going to be crowned sometime next uh, spring. So we're talking about months of this where people will not be allowed to express themselves in public, maybe online, but not in public. And where are, and I have to ask this, uh, this simple question, where are the so-called free speech advocates? The ones that you see appearing on LBC or GB News whenever there's some issue of, of uh, I don't know, a story in uh, in the paper about Winston Churchill being cancelled from some college course or something like that. Where are these people? Completely silent. When we have a clear example of someone's freedom of expression being taken away from them, being moved along, told to go away, or in some cases being arrested for breaching the peace. I don't know what else to say about this. It just seems to be getting worse and worse. And for the moment, the UK is abiding, it seems, uh, by abiding by the European Convention on Human Rights. But there are Tories within the House of Commons who want to get rid of that. There are people very close to Liz Truss who want to get, get rid of the European Convention on Human Rights. They see, they see it as something that's a problem. Let me know in the comment section, guys, what you think about all of this. As always, your comments are greatly appreciated. Thanks a lot.